Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Icebreakers Invitationals, where we fight for money and talk about punching Christian babies. Would you still punch the Christian baby? <laughs> Here's my journey through the EBI bracket. To start off, my first game was a win against Orphan, scores are on the screen now, followed by a game against Frog that was something like... After that devastating spin move, we moved on to day two of the event, still in winner's bracket. This story, however, wouldn't last long. We were being put up against Dopey Tater Chip, someone who's known for being one of the best players in the game. Day two. What the crap was that? After some strategizing with the blaze bond, we came to the conclusion that my high seed were allowing me to host, plus picking my main, I should be able to get through at least the first round. Like what's up danger? Like what's up danger? Like what's up danger? But after starting the game down two hits, I couldn't see it being possible. But I didn't need to. After the reverse sweep of a lifetime, I figured the next game on his host would have to be a throwaway round to get my host back. I still manage a nice head tap, but we need to pull it back in the third game. I picked Samurai to play around his Persian knowing good and well I couldn't take that match. But the bluff was successful, and we got him on his night instead. But once again, he pulled the first two rounds, and we were going to need the second reverse sweep of the game. Unfortunately, this didn't happen, knocking us down the loose bracket. We were playing against Owl, we're thinking about using the longsword to counter him.
after a glorious 3-1 and getting obliterated on Viking, I realized something I didn't want to play for another few hours. I had places to be, so I picked Tyrant knowing good and well I am terrible with it, and that marks the end for my dream. Thanks so much for watching, and thanks to Oolong for hosting the event. Go check him out.